since the 054A frigate was finalized at the beginning of this century, there has not been any major technical improvement. The overall design tends to be aging, and it is suspected of hindering the team. Therefore, since its latest modification, Type 054B, has quickly become an internet celebrity model that military fans are concerned about since it was exposed. The 054B frigate under construction was accidentally pushed to the hot search by an enthusiastic Japanese netizen. This ship under construction the first 054B frigate is launched. Some analysts even believe that the performance of the new 054B frigate overlaps with that of the 052D destroyer, which may threaten the latter's use positioning. The modification has several key changes, the a new type of radar on the 054B ship island is a double-sided rotating array radar. Compared with the 346A4 sided array radar on the 055 and 052 destroyer, the cost is greatly reduced, while the performance is not much reduced. From the front in terms of diameter, it is much larger than the Sampson radar of the European Type 45 destroyer, which means that when both sides are double-sided array radar systems, our new radar is stronger than the same type of European system and cooperates with the Type 364X band low-altitude blind filling radar and Type 366 over-the-horizon radar are used. Medium and short-range air defense missiles like Hihunki-16 have high precision and strong interception capabilities, and their comprehensive performance is very powerful. Judging from the volume of the entire ship, the number of vertical units should still remain the same as the 054A, with 32 units. The domestic vertical launch system adopts an advanced vertical launch system for cold and hot missiles, which can be compatible with the launch modes of different types of missiles at the same time. Therefore, from this aspect, the 054B can attack while defending, which greatly improves the combat capability. Some analysts believe that the 054B frigate uses an all-electric propulsion system powered by one gas turbine plus two diesel engines, which can not only guarantee a speed of 30 knots and above, but also the quietness and acceleration brought by all-electric propulsion are very suitable for anti-submarine warfare. Therefore, it is speculated that the target of the ship is anti-submarine air defense, and it should focus more on anti-submarine. In the future, after the 054B frigate joins the guard with knife combination of the domestic aircraft carrier formation, the formation's anti-submarine shortcomings will be greatly strengthened. Interestingly, due to the use of a larger hull 5,000 tons by visual inspection, the 054B frigate not only has first-class anti-submarine capabilities, but also has powerful air defense and sea land attack capabilities. If it is equipped with Hihunki 9 long-range air defense missiles, the air defense capability will be at the same level as foreign air defense destroyers. If it is equipped with IG-18 and IG-21 long-range missiles, it will also have independent sea and land attack capabilities. For this conclusion, there are two mainstream views in external analysis, the experience of the US Navy tells us that a fleet mainly composed of large ships actually has a great waste of resources. The US Navy's active surface warships are all composed of large destroyers and cruisers, with a weight of more than 9,000 tons. All aviation needs to dispatch 10,000 ton large ships, which is undoubtedly a waste of resources and a burden. As a party with a late mover advantage, the Chinese Navy will naturally not ignore such low-level mistakes made by the US military. The cost of 054B is only about half of that of 052D. Since the performance is similar, it is speculated that after the advent of 054B, whether the construction of 052D will be terminated and the economical and applicable 054B will be mass-produced and 055 will be implemented in the future domestic aircraft carrier formation. Destroyer plus 054B frigate combination of light and heavy aircraft carrier with knife guard. Speculation 2. Combining 052D and 054B, after the 055 electromagnetic gun is put into practical use, it will be transformed into a cruiser alone. Another point of view is that the comprehensive performance of the 055 large-scale drive is strong, 
and it is too useful to escort the aircraft carrier formation. After the electromagnetic gun technology is practical in the future, the new generation of 055 destroyers equipped with electromagnetic main guns will inevitably become all-round. Land and sea destroyers cruisers are developing some netizens call it the era of new cannon giant ships. At that time, 052D and 054B will be used together to escort the aircraft carrier formation's air defense and anti-submarine. From the perspective of ship type, the Type 054B frigate adopts the international mainstream long forecastle ship type. This ship type is more typical of the Lafayette-class frigate of the French Navy. Riyadh-class frigate. Moreover, a fully sheltered front deck is adopted, and the windlass, bollards and anchor chains of the original bow front deck are placed in the lower cabin, which will also improve the overall stealth performance of the ship. But don't worry too much about the limited view and operating space of the front deck operators when the ship is unmooring and towing when it leaves the dock. China's third-generation frigates have already adopted a fully enclosed stern and various operations already very skilled. Finally, the most different part of the Type 054B frigate compared to other surface combat ships of the Chinese Navy is the all-electric propulsion. This type of ship adopts the medium-voltage DC integrated power system developed by the team of academician Ma Weiming of the Naval University of Engineering. The integrated power system adopts medium voltage the direct current system breaks through the system frequency limit, lowers the requirements for the prime mover's speed regulation characteristics, cancels the large capacity propulsion transformer and distribution transformer, and eliminates the skin effect of the current, greatly reduces the volume and weight of the equipment, and improves system efficiency and power supply continuity. In any case, it's time to build a general-purpose frigate with high quality, low price, moderate firepower, and strong endurance. The Chinese Navy's future model matching will provide another choice. What do you think?